In tonight with our continuing coverage of the cause for reparations for the 1921 race massacre. Mayor Bynum is now weighing in and his answer is no. Hi everyone, thanks for joining us tonight at 6. I'm Mark Bradshaw. And I'm Neely Jones. Channel 8's Kim Jackson has been following this story for us and she found out the city is only offering redevelopment to rebuild what the community lost. Kim joins us live now with the latest on the mayor's plan. Kim? Well, the city of Tulsa has a plan that would allow citizens to decide what they would like to go in two different locations, but some say this is not a replacement for reparations. Lives, homes, and property were lost in the race massacre of 1921 and no one was held accountable. And as a mayor, I hate that. I don't want Tulsa to be a city where the bad guys win. And this is an opportunity for us, even a century after the fact, to put Tulsa on the right course moving forward. Now, decades later, there's a master plan for a centennial anniversary, but no plans for reparations. What about reparations in this area? I, I'm not... I don't have it. I know people have opinions on both sides when it comes to reparations, but the things I'm focused on, uh, that, that's just not a, you know, cash payments to people. Instead, the mayor's focused on property the city owns near the Greenwood area to be redeveloped. That's definitely not reparations. That's definitely not justice. Um, and that's definitely not, you know, what we as a community uh, need as far as healing. Pastor Robert Turner has been I'm marching for reparations, but the mayor says the work hey. they are doing is hard enough. We're having a hard enough time right now, and we're going to have a hard time tracking down the descendants uh, of the victims of the massacre in, in our grave search. As plans move ahead and the search for victims remains, the city is also ready to begin the process of developing property near the new BMX training center. Most of the land would be for businesses and development. And there are plans to develop acres of land near 244, land the city gained from urban renewal. I don't give you credit for developing property that you should not have, that you should never own in the first place. I, I, I don't give you credit for that. The mayor says it's a plan to build wealth that was lost and to bring all of Tulsa together. I think getting into trying to make cash payments to people, it divides the community on something that we really need to be united around. And right now, a city committee is reviewing proposals for a national planning group that would come in and talk to citizens about what they would like to see done. Live in West Tulsa, Kim Jackson, Tulsa's Channel 8.